listen to their motivational and inspirational words and now with a very happy heart very respectfully i am inviting our own professor professor priti saxena ma'am who is the professor in the department of human rights and the director of cpgls school of legal studies and the co-director of the webinar and who is really a source of inspiration for all of us ma'am we are eagerly waiting for to listen your views on the thing thank you so much rashida uh, good evening to one and all and a very happy international women's day uh, rightly told uh, that uh, today we are commemorating the international women's day 21 uh, for the theme uh, women's in leadership achieving an equal future in a covid 19 world and uh, i welcome uh, professor nishtha jaswal ji who is really a leader and uh, madam uh, major praveen kumari ji who is the special guest of this function uh, professor rana pratap singh who is presiding over the program and the other colleagues from the department and the, and the university as a whole and my dear students uh, as you know that uh, this uh, international women day uh, somehow it was started in 1908 or 9 in united states by socialist party and uh, then uh, uh, since 1920 onwards we see that it began to be celebrated annually by communist parties first in soviet union and then in china but at international level from united nations it was in 1975 march 8 so that was proclaimed uh, by the united nations for women's right and international peace and since 1977 this day is commemorated as international women's day Uh, so far as india is concerned we know that india has started on a regular basis from march 8 1980 so since then there is commemoration on march 8th every year uh, out of 365 days women has been allotted one day that is 8th march so this is <laughs> something uh, which uh, i should say that women who is uh, participating in each sphere in every part or every functioning in the society has been given one day for celebration so among many international days we see which have been started uh, by united nations uh, this women day is commemorated almost everywhere and it is not only confined to the nation states in government sectors but private corporations they are also participating in the women rights celebration uh, the theme chosen by the department for this webinar balancing between life and work during covid Uh, a challenging scenario for uh, working women is very very apt and uh, in view of the last one year covid pandemic lockdown and work from home scenario uh, there has been an unprecedented outburst of writings about the effects of the pandemic on lockdown not only in india but across the world much has been written about the impact of covid 19 on the working from home and the impact of working from home on the rights of the persons particularly women who has to perform dual responsibilities for the whole day as a working women earning salary and as a working women without salary uh, i'm talking of the without salary working women as a homemaker who did her best and made a balance between life and work so that the family could not face any problem but they are not salaried women then uh, being locked down during pandemic was otherwise uh, locked in for the workers uh, it is not only the women who was locked in but all the family members the kids the husbands and the other male members they are all uh, locked in during the lockdown and they had to work from the home children have to study from home males have to perform their duties from home including women during pandemic and many people you see that including women they lost their jobs and had to stay at home the home uh, which was uh, the workplace for women has become a workplace for everyone in